I was just uh, staring at that wall of penises. And then I literally just like shook my head and said, what the fuck am I doing? I mean, I'm on a path. <laughs> but uh, I don't know how long I'm going to last in this particular line of business. And it's not the clientele because... If anything I relate to these weirdos, maybe not the old creepy dudes that are hanging out in the back for hours trying to get their dicks up, but more to the addict uh, types. So it's definitely not that. But it's the fucking bosses, the idiot I work with, their caveman attitudes, how they're all the bad, how they're all bad and they all steal. Meanwhile, they are the only ones that actually spent money in the spa today. Both of the, they, not even together, separate days, if you will, both spending over a hundred dollars on shit here. But they were all bad. I can't do this shit. Anymore. Come very close to threatening to slap the shit out of the cops. Besides the fact that ten dollars is missing and the motherfucker made me run my pockets to show that uh, I didn't take it. So, restrain myself on several levels of uh, <laughs> of not threatening to slap the shit out of this cops. And uh, not robbing the fucking place. Or at least getting my fucking money that I worked for the past two days in my two hours training that I'm not supposed to not getting paid for. I'm just walking out the fucking door and telling these motherfuckers to suck a dick. Besides the fact the boss asked me when, when I got hired if I was gay and me saying no and him saying good because uh, we don't want gay people working here. Never mind the fact that uh, the only reason... I was hired because the way I look, which in within itself is pretty gay. So we're going to end this transmission with the wall of dildos uh, to the left of me. And uh, the wall of dildos compared to the, the, the vagina section is just there's like 10% vaginas and like 90% fucking dildos. All right, we're going to end this transmission in uh, dildo hell. Uh, Chelsea, New York City, with uh, bosses who well, I will not bother to mention their nationalities, even though it's such an important issue with them and their sexualities. I should let my boss know. I say, you know, after two days of working here, looking at all these cocks, I'm pretty sure I'm a gay dude now. So I think you're gonna have to just fire me.